Hi, I'm Rishi Vasuki with Microchip Technology, and thanks for watching this short video in which we will show you some simple cost-effective development tools and advanced algorithms to control your motors. As a leader in motor control technologies, Microchip is continually investing in developing new, innovative digital signal controller products, new algorithms and software, new development tools, and training courses. With me today is Daniel Torres from our application engineering team. Daniel develops motor control solutions for us. Daniel, so what do we have here today? Hi, Rishi. We have a DSPICDEM MCLB development board. Uh, this board is uh, developed for controlling permanent mag magnet synchronous motor, brushless DC motor uh, using sensorless or sensored algorithms such as FOC or uh, trapezoidal um, control. Uh, can you show us some features on this board? Yeah, sure. Right here we have the three-phase inverter um, and the motor connector. This stage of the board it's um, able to control any motor from 0 volts up to 48 volts and up to 10 amps. We have the whole sensor connectors and the power supply for connection for the motor. We also have right here the DSPIC33F device which can be um, plugged through the plug-in module, 100 pin plug-in module, or we can also have a 28 pin SOIC device. Uh, we have the uh, debugger and programmer connectors that can be attached to the MPLAV, ICD2, or that can be attached to uh, any MPLAV realized device. We have the RG11 version or the ICSP version. We also have uh, the communication section which is compounded by the RS-232 connector, uh, the USB to UART bridge, CAN, and LIN. We also have the power supply section, which is compounded by a 15 volts regulator, 5 volts regulator, and a 3.3 regulator. We also have uh, a selection for different signals, depending on the algorithm you're going to use for control the motor. So uh, I can see the, there's a motor here. What what exactly is this demo doing right now? Yeah, this demo is um, controlling the motor using the filler in control technique, dual shunt sensorless, and we are using our DSPIC 33F um, FG 32MC204 device. So you can see here that I can stop or run the motor in a sensorless way. I can use the pot to control the speed of the motor and start the and completely stop the motor. We have this uh, interface, um, the MCI, which is data monitor control interface, along with a real-time debugger monitor um, embedded into the application to show any variable on the application and to be able to plot um, for arrays. So right here we are showing faces, the motor faces and um, the motor neutral point. Okay. So is this uh, software that you're running on this chip, is it available somewhere? Yeah, it's available on the microchip web page. Uh, you can find it under AN1078. Um, the application note is a sensorless FOC um, algorithm for permanent magnet synchronous motors or brushless DC motors. We have a motor control demo controlling a sensorless trapezoidal brushless DC algorithm and I am able to control it using my laptop computer uh, using uh, the MCI. The MCI is a data monitor control interface running under MPLAB IDE. It also works along with a real-time data monitor which is a source code resident in, into the target device. So you may see here that I am able to increase or decrease the speed of the motor in a real-time fashion. I can start or stop the motor. I can record and show the faces. I can enable or disable the PIE controller and I can change the PIE parameters. This demo is running um, using the AN1160 app node, which is um, already available on the Microchip webpage. Excellent. 
And uh, MPLAB IDE uh, with this data monitor and control interface is also... Uh, it's also it? available on the Microsoft web page. Mm -hmm. uh, it's on the um, code example CE115. Oh, excellent. Thanks, Daniel. Thanks again very much for that. We hope you find the DSPICDEM MCLV development board, the tools, and the software useful in your next design. You can find all this information at microchip.com slash motor. DSPIC digital signal controllers are ideally suited to help you achieve your goals of increasing energy efficiency, reducing noise, lowering system cost, and providing better torque control or improving reliability in your motorized applications. DSPICs typically control three-phase AC induction motors, sensored or sensorless brushless DC motors, permanent magnet motors, and switch reluctance motors. We also have an expert team uh, which will be ready to help you with your next design challenge. Just contact a microchip sales office near you. Thanks again for watching this video. I'm Rishi with Microchip Digital Signal Controller Group. We'll see you next time.